Hi guys and welcome. If you want to build your own website or landing page, definitely you need to watch this video because I want to show you today the step-by-step -step tutorial of how to build your own web page on this fantastic, very convenient and very user-friendly platform that called Lead Pages. Uh, this is the main site uh, you just just need to check. Uh, and before I've started to show you the small, uh, fast and uh, very powerful step-by-step -step tutorial of how to make that happen, how to build your own landing page, um, I want to say that our team left the link in the description panel of this video so you can easily get access to the Lead Pages platform with a big discount for our friends and for our subscribers. Check that link, get a discount and jump in to build your own, your first or maybe not first landing page or web page because it's pretty similar. Let's jump to the dashboard of this fantastic tool, uh, landing pages and sites. Uh, I want to show you uh, the example on landing pages. Here you can sort by conversion rate, most popular, newest page type, industry in the page type. So there's plenty, it's a list of, a list of tools like event, free resource and download, sales and so on. Industry, if you make an automotive or education of home services or other health and wellness, you can find everything that you want. Even you can choose a style, bold, casual, colorful, dark, elegant, light, minimal, professional, uh, or you can choose by color even. Uh, so, th in a matter of fact, you can build everything that you want just literally with couple clicks. And I want to show it to you. This is absolutely easy and this is absolutely fast. So, for example, uh, let build some real estate company that just coming in uh, to the market and in this case I will show you on this case I will show you how to manage things and how you can edit things uh, in in order and what's important and what's not so important and you will figure out how to build your own web page because the editing feature is pretty similar for landing pages and for web pages like for big site with a lot of content the editing features is absolutely the same. So let's jump into this button. So I will um, I will describe all this. Uh, you press in the layout. You see the hero and the footer. This is the sections, and everything here is pretty built with the sections. You can add a section from here straight, or you can add a section from this sections button. And you, you can see this about call to action, contact us and so on and so on and you can just choose uh, one of them and you can drag and drop it all these blue boxes means that you can place it here all right hero uh, testimonials for example just also in a second it appears right here and you see that that's that's pretty easy and if you didn't found the block that already made for you you can uh, manage it by yourself you see there's a blank sections that you can use for your purposes uh, just drag and drop it okay here in the layout you see that the footer is okay uh, on the bottom testimonials blank and hero hero one uh, for example you need to reorder these things you just grab in it and place into the, uh, to the where you want it to be. That's pretty simple. You can delete it, you can duplicate it, you can make it visible or invisible. And here uh, you see the section style, row one, row two, and you, you see what's happening inside the section with this small uh, arrow button. We're gonna delete this one. We're gonna delete now this one, we, we're gonna leave this one, testimonials, we're gonna delete. Uh, on this example, I will show you how to manage things. Okay, everything in any landing page, any web page is built within the layers uh, and there are background, there are some content like text, images and videos and there are interactive elements like here in widgets. I will show it to you, show less, for simplicity, text, image and text, image, video, button, form, line and space. That's everything actually you need to build your own web page. If you're gonna press show more, there's 
icon, progress bar, social, social like, and so on and so on. Tons of features. Uh, but actually, all you're gonna use is this, uh, this eight things. When we scrolling down, you see drag and drop widgets here to get started. And we just making this happen. Like I want this image to be here. I want this video to be here. Cool, cool. When you jump into layout and you see this blank one, you press in this button, you see column, column, and you can add a row or a column. I can make it happen like that. And for example, I need the text only here. And here you go. How to manage the text, all the editing features uh, made with this pencil button. You see that there's a text and I'm sure that you know how to type the text, yeah? Uh, you can change the size of it. You can use the jumbo. You can use the headings, headline one, uh, headline two, headline three. Actually, this is important to, if you have a big amount of um, content, big text, you need to use this jumbo and headings to uh, to show to search engines that this is a heading and this is just small text. You can change the font straight from here to any font that you want. Of course, you can make it bold, you can make it italic and so on. And you can change the color of the text and you can make it in the center of the block and so on. If you want to move it, you just grab in this this arrows button and you move it straight here if you need a spacer you're dropping it right here and you're resizing the you're resizing the picture also also you have this blue line and you can move it to the sides and reshape the forms and buttons and all the widgets that you have that's pretty it. I'm just deleting this block and we're jumping in to edit this one. When we press in this three button, you have the name of the block, name of the section. And when we press in this three buttons, we can add a section above or below straight from here, not from the sections straight from here. We can duplicate, copy or delete this thing, or we can add a section setting. We can see that there's an image. For example, this is agency i don't know what was this agency is about i will change this image for example we have a real estate agency yeah as, as i told you in the uh, in the start of this video you can use images that are uploaded already by you you can use premium images you can buy them uh, and you see there's like tons of interesting images but it's eight bucks per picture and if you need a lot of such pictures you will have to you will need to pay like for each one or you can upload your own if you have a content that you created and you own that content with all your rights you just can upload it straight from your computer and that's what i'm gonna do right now okay the picture is uploaded i'm just pressing insert and you see the picture is down there and you see that there's a cover uh, image color overlay. We're going to delete it. You see that the picture is pretty white. Yeah, and I don't like it because text is pretty invisible here. So we need to apply the color overlay and we're going to add a new one just to show you. You can choose any color and you change and just change the opacity. And OK, it's working like some kind of filter. Yeah, when you using the black one and like real estate agency, like buy from us, subscribe for updates and that's it. That's pretty cool. You see, everything is visible. Everything is great. But the most important thing that I wanted to show you here, uh, like text, you get an idea of how to manage the text. Yeah, don't you? Uh, but main things and this is absolutely important information. Main things here is the buttons, actually, because that's the way how your visitor interact with your page. 
the main purpose of on any landing page or website is to bring new customer yeah and how you can bring new customer you need to get his contact information if you're not selling straight from this um, this website you need to grab his contact information email phone number uh, and name and second name yeah how can you do that you can do it only with uh buttons so you can edit this button how to edit button everything is editing with this pencil button you can change the style it can be the big with the full width it can be left right or center square rounded and when you can change the shape of the corners it can be round like circular it can be flat it can be line and it can be gradient i like the flat and line and i like the square let it be line uh the same thing you can change the color of background and hover text uh, and you can play around with all this actually but the most important thing is this added click event the click event is very very important thing what's gonna happen uh no link option and your button will not work open a pop-up uh open a calendar pop-up jump to page section if uh, if happening something like uh, read more yeah and somebody pressing the button you will your page will scroll automatically to the uh, place to the section like about link to landing page or external uh, url we're gonna use a pop-up and in most cases uh, as a pop-up edit the pop-up all right want to stay in the loop subscribe and let us know when your site launches uh, the same thing is uh, with the text with the editing with the styles and so on the style of this section is also here for example we can uh, we can change the section style and we can uh, make it like white and nothing is visible we can make it black and let it be black just to show you how you can uh how you can make it it's automatically 50 75 all right let it be automatically and the same thing with integrations this is very important thing and i wanted to show you first of all lead notifications how you're gonna get the information you will get uh email to your email that you fulfilled here or you can add an integration and this is absolutely fantastic or you get because you can use more external services like if you have an email marketing provider like mailchimp get response convert kit and you're running your um uh, ad campaigns via email that's a perfect tool and you can you can integrate any tool of this list to your web page straightly and you will get notifications when somebody will Fill up the form you will get notifications to your uh, email marketing system and the new customer will jump in straight to your email list and in that case you can send them updates you can send them new news uh, or new items if you're selling something new uh, discounts and bonuses and coupons and so on and so on you need to warm up those audience or if you don't have uh, such uh, email marketing provider you can integrate all with the zapier and you see active campaign autopilot mercury google sheets even it, so you can make uh, the google sheets integrate with your website and the new customer will be appeared in, in your google sheets that's pretty cool and pretty fantastic you need to check it before you go live but if you're just starting lead notification is pretty enough um, fields you see that there's only email i want to add a field i want a first name for example and it's done want to re uh, remove this site up first name email Alrighty, and actions what's gonna happen okay i fulfilled this form what's gonna happen i'm gonna see the default lead pages thank you page that's pretty great and you can manage this page or you can make landing page or external url or remain in page external url if uh, if you're selling something and you want to build the cross sell or upsell or something like that this external url can be handy but the full lead pages thank you page is actually pretty enough all right widgets i showed you the layouts the sections the widgets and styles here in the styles you you can change the font styles uh 
for all the headlines, for all the text, you can choose different types of fonts. And that's pretty cool and that's pretty great. Now, actually, I suggest you not to use more than two fonts for entire page because uh, in other case it looks not so good and it looks not professional so not more than three colors not more than three fonts it's maximum Better to use two like black and white also you know, always cool decision and uh, you know, some palettes with the color the contrast and all the things that's pretty pretty interesting and this lead matter up here uh, shows you the the excellence of your uh, web page build like all the fonts all the things uh, because the platform itself has tons of experience in uh, conversion and and they know when the web page will convert with the high results or uh, when it's going to be bad so you need this lead matter to be as high as possible right here we build the interesting web page lead matters shows that it's excellent and it's pretty enough for me and i showed you all the things except the settings settings seo uh you need to fulfill all these things like seo page description keywords uh, and uh, definitely you need the search engines to uh, see your web page social if you want to share the link for your page to some facebook or pinterest or, or someone else you need to upload this uh, some kind of image here uh, it can be poster or it can be something something like that it can be the picture that you used to the background and all these descriptions analytics if you want to know what's happening with the traffic on your web page definitely you need to uh, integrate your google analytics tracking id uh, or some other services so guys that's pretty it i showed you the core knowledges of how to edit things and in that uh, in that shape you can move things around you can add things you can edit them you can change the styles you can change the fonts and that's pretty easy and this platform is absolutely user friendly and if you want to try to build your own web page right now jump into the uh, description panel of this video because there our team left the link for you and if you want to get access to lead pages platform with a big discount from our team to our friends use that link i hope this all makes sense guys i hope this all was useful i tried to make this video as short as possible not to waste your time and i showed you the core knowledge that you will use to build your own web page or landing page or uh, even a big big website thanks for watching this video till the end Hope you enjoyed and hope this was useful. See you in the next video. Have a great day and bye-bye.